so before we get into today's video i kind of wanted to explain what you guys can expect even though y'all probably like girl we already seen this video two times we know what to expect i feel like this one is a little bit different you know for a couple reasons and i feel like the only way for me to answer what may be potential questions is you know adding it onto the video like this because my comments are disabled they've been disabled for quite a while and i don't have control over that so if you guys would like to keep up with me or you have any questions or would just like to you know keep up with me when i'm not posting on youtube my socials are always down below including my spam account which is the account i'm always logged in on i'm on that account the most if you guys have kept up with my moving process thus far if not it's nice to have you here whether you have been keeping up to date or not i feel like this will still be an enjoyable video to watch but today's video is different because i'm done apartment hunting i'm done i've looked at nine apartments this time around and I fell in love with the seventh one that I looked at even after falling in love with the seventh I did of course you know go through with the other tours I had scheduled for this day if I could give you any advice I'm only 19 years old I'm still super young growing on a daily learning on the daily this is going to be my second time moving out I feel like I can go into this second round of moving with a little more knowledge or even just kind of know what to expect a little bit more than I did the first time because the first time I mean it was my first time I've already kind of went into this but I'm not gonna be sure showing the apartment that I actually plan on staying in just because I feel like I feel like we need to wait for like the big reveal I'd just rather wait until you know we're a little closer to moving day because I do not move out until March we got time basically my goal was to go ahead and start looking early I wanted to start looking a lot earlier than I did moving previously so now here I am you know I don't move for another three months and I already have my future apartment set one thing that I made a priority when it came to this round of apartment hunting or this whole process of moving out of my current place was to look everywhere. I looked at places that, you know, I knew I would really like as soon as I walked in, places that I knew I probably would not want to live, but I still wanted to just be able to say that I looked, right? For me personally, I thought it was important for me to just check out a little bit of everything and, you know, kind of learn what I may not want in my next place, what I do want in my next place and kind of mesh everything together and, you know, find something that's right in the middle that works really well for me. Very happy that I made sure to take this trip multiple times because the first time around when we we went apartment hunting there was this one place that i i absolutely loved it was so beautiful i loved the area i loved the vibe i was getting when i walked in but then i happened to find that at some other places and it wasn't until this third trip where i knew 100 percent i wanted to go so with all that being said i hope this video is still enjoyable even though i'm not gonna show you guys exactly you know where i'm gonna be staying in the next couple of months but the other apartments i looked at were absolutely gorgeous as well overall it was a super fun day and an amazing experience definitely wanted to you know still share this experience with you guys but i wanted to let y'all know that in advance so this video isn't misleading but with all that being said let's go ahead and get started <laughs> hey guys good morning so i know you guys clicked on the video you guys saw the title and you're like again <laughs> uh in today's video we are basically going to be going apartment hunting this is going to be round three so i'm here we got we got sienna over here we got tamia over here and then we got simi me all the way over there lee is going to be coming with as well if you guys have kept up with the little series that we have going on when it comes to apartment hunting we've basically just been you know looking around seeing what's out there because as i've mentioned i am moving to a city that i'm not super familiar with i'm just making it a priority to you know just explore just see what's out there and make sure i look at different complexes and different areas in the city to see what i feel is best so my goal overall was to look at at least 10 to 15 places and today we'll make it nine so we're getting there it's been a fun process and the ones that we're looking at today i'm actually super excited about one of them is actually one that we had attempted to tour in the last apartment video if you guys did watch that video you guys would have seen how there was one that we really wanted to go to we had to you know schedule it in advance which makes complete sense so we did schedule in advance this time around and we're going to check that one out today along with two others that's the plan for today and i'm going to be taking you guys with us and i'm very excited so i think lee's finishing getting ready right now so we're just kind of uh, you know waiting on him we'll probably swing by starbucks or something and get some food so yeah we're just kind of chilling and we plan to head out head that way soon I lee decorated or did. lee and i decorated his room for christmas okay. and look how cute it is the rooms it's like at the top like the kind of like attic looking mm -hmm. they're like really spacey but you wouldn't think hey <laughs> all right guys so we're all in the car now 
all five of us and we just went to Starbucks. I got a, this is my new favorite drink. Actually, it's me trying to switch it up, but it's literally the same drink I normally get, but like a Frappuccino version. This is a chai cream Frappuccino with three espresso shots in it. And normally I just get this drink iced, but it's super good as a Frappuccino and it's actually a lot more enjoyable to drink. And then I also got a breakfast sandwich and lemon pound cake. We're on the way to the first complex now. It says we're gonna get there at 123 and then it starts at two. So we're gonna have some extra time, which is good. All right, so we just made it to the first apartment complex. I am so excited. So basically our appointments today, because you have to, you know, schedule to go on each tour. First one is at two. Then right now it's like around 120. I made sure to not schedule them as far apart this time. Since last time we just had a lot of space in between. Oh, you have to call the leasing out there, that's good. There's always stuff to do here. Um, you're gonna definitely have like the most activity going on in this area, which is really nice. Like the nice are going right in here. Mm -hmm. um, sorry, I just looked at a little bit of construction stuff in here. Um, oh. This is our south facing. You're gonna get the sunset on this side. Oh, I'm sorry, this is the best one I've seen. <laughs> this is beautiful. Yeah, we love our property here. It's pretty nice. You kind of have a kind of like studio with the one bedroom. It really gives me like a New York feel. California. Holy fuck. Yeah, this is the one I'm Look at this. All right, guys, so we are now leaving the first apartment complex. This was our tour that we had scheduled at two. We got there a little early and she allowed us to go ahead and tour the property. So the apartment we toured was a one bedroom, which is what I've been looking at since, I don't know if you guys watched the first apartment video I did, but in that video I explained how I'm looking to downsize. So I've been intentionally looking at one bedrooms since we've been hunting because as I expressed in my first video, I am looking to downsize because whenever I first moved into my two bedroom, I had a reason to have two bedrooms but now I do not so that's what we've been looking at and that's what she had toured us and she took us through three apartments which I thought was nice because she showed just a different variety of things that they have to offer when it comes to either having a city view or a more closed off view and then also the difference between having a bedroom that's closed off and then having a more open floor plan so that gave me a lot of variety to just see the different selection that they have and what I could potentially see myself in so that was awesome and yeah. It was really beautiful and I was honestly blown away. I like how this is a more private complex There's a very limited amount of people on each floor, which I think is really cool I feel like that complex set the bar pretty high for today and I am excited to look at this second one This was the one we're about to go to was actually the one I was most excited about but yeah, we're on the way We're really close. We're gonna get there a little bit early, but not as early as the last one So we should be able to just walk in and do our thing but super excited. My goal every time we tour is for me to at least have one place that I really like. So then it kind of gives me numerous options that I really like. So we're literally at the next complex. So this will be exciting. Okay, alrighty. Hey, how you doing? Hey, good. I'm gonna be your mailwoman here. Okay. This is actually going to be the first apartment that we're gonna be tour. So this is like if you did like Just Fresh, which is one of those kind of services where you get your food pre-order mm -hmm. and you're not here. We'll be able to store it for you. Excuse me, I'm sorry. Cool. Okay. Um, we're also going to do like a pantry. So we'll try to so it kind of makes like a hotel. That's, cool. That's really yeah. cool. Where you this can really kind of like room. really kind of grab and go mm -hmm. for things that we need to forget and you'll be able to kind of get them. That's awesome. Yeah. That's so nice. Really nice, right? Yeah. I, I, haven't, like, I haven't had a place where I've seen that before. Me neither. I was about to say What do you have now? How you put your packages? Guys, it's like Amazon. Yeah, right? Amazon. Okay, so this is going to be like a Luxor package. So what will happen is when you have a package, they'll send you a code. Mm -hmm. When you punch the code in, the door is going to open and get your package. Oh, that's cool. Yes. yes. Very secure. So Very secure. Everybody else can get it. It's like the only your code. So this is the wellness wing. So in here is going to be another like open top of space. So you'll be able to have come in here if you want to sit. This is going to have MacBooks on it. Mm -hmm. So you'll be able to kind of utilize if you don't have a computer or something. Oh, cool. You'll be able to kind of sit in here and utilize it. We have water. Um, fancy water for you guys. Fancy water. Fancy water. We love it. <laughs> <laughs> Hotbox is going to be when you're getting ready to sign up for people next door. We have bathrooms here. Yes. The gym is probably, it's my favorite, but I don't want to utilize it, which is wrong. <laughs> 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 but it's, it's my favorite part to show. I'm like, oh, this gym is everything. Don't even use it. <laughs> <laughs> it's nice though. It is. So this is how you open it. The thing I do like about it, it is not connected to the building, so it oh, forces yeah. you to come out. True. You know what I mean? Something to get, get out the house, house yeah. right across so the, the street. Exactly. You're like, oh, I don't really want to go, but it forces you to kind of 
get into the mood, get that cardio going. But you have free weights, you have a row machine, you have a step machine behind you. Yeah, this is I would awesome. probably say everything that you see in a gym, you'll see in here. Yeah. I'm a membership with Planet Fitness right now. <laughs> cancel it. Right. Save your own money, save money. Right, because you have just about everything. You're, we're going to have well beats in here, so you'll be able to do like last classes. But it feels very mm -hmm. fresh. Like, yeah. It's not like feet. So yes. that's good. That's yeah. good. <laughs> <laughs> they do it. I will say the good thing about it is our cleaners really do come in here and clean. And then we have like a masculine scent that runs through here. So we be faking like people be really, really working at <laughs> But they probably don't be. <laughs> now it's time to look at some of our What time have you been? Yeah, we've been all over the place. Oh, we told you to look at last time. Hey, what's going on? It's so bright. Very yeah. Very open. Let's take a look at this one. Welcome home. Welcome home. Oh, wow. Okay. So I'm going to point out some differences. Because all of our mentality on the floor are kind of the same. So I will say the differences is you have your blackout shades. Okay. Your ceilings are all going to be 10 feet. Black finishes, the matte finishes, the sweet on. Um, Sliding so this is more of a kind of like a German engineered refrigerator. Yo, I was about to say it looks different. So it gives you more oh, wow. of a sleek look. And then you have all of your functions at the top. Oh, okay. So you'll be able to set it if you have, say for instance, I always joke because I live here with my boyfriend, I'll tell him I'm gonna put the child lock on. <laughs> so he <laughs> doesn't need my food up. <laughs> but it does come with like child proof on and off, lights, you can do the temperature, and then you have your food at the bottom. Oh, cool. But Dr. let me get you some lights. Please walk around. The toilet is cool. The shower. Look at the little indent in the wall. Oh, it's cool. Put your products in it. You should go in and close the door. <laughs> Great. This is a shower. Space in the shower is very important. Definitely. I always call the bathroom my comfort area. Are you sure? Area. You gotta have it. Yep, I, I will sit in the bathroom for an hour. Be sitting on the toilet for so an hour, girl. Really? Yeah, what you doing? My business. Right. <laughs> okay, walk in closet. Pretty. Yes. Does this lead to the room? Yes. Okay. The toilet's so yeah. like modern. It's like, yeah, it's different. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So they're more of a German company and they came to the States. So a lot of their decor, a lot of how they do their apartment styles is more on a European look. So like your toilet. Your refrigerator, your stove top, mm -hmm. your dishwasher is more of that sweet European. Yeah, it's definitely different. Yeah. Like even the sink. Mm -hmm. Really pretty. The farm style sink. So then, this is going to be for your TV. So if you want to hang a flat screen, mm -hmm. it just helps with the wiring. Okay. So your wiring doesn't show. But if you need like assistance, which okay. depends, you would have more of a sunset view. Okay. Yeah, I like seeing movement when I walk outside. You want to see outside. You yeah. Outside. yeah. Yeah. This is so much space. I feel like there's so much to do out here. <laughs> right. You could really make this room your oasis. And you could really okay. decorate it. You yeah. Know, put put some chairs up here. Are you ready though? Yeah, I'm joking. Ready? Are you ready? Yeah. That's all this time. Well, it's more separated. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm moving so slow. <laughs> I'm over here like trying to get like good footage. I'm so sorry. Well, this feels like a toss. Doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah, that is really good. Yeah, that is really cool. Wait, is that a hallway? Yeah, there's like a little hallway. Yes. Okay, kitchen. Okay, kitchen. <laughs> okay, let's talk about it, this girl. This is so... <laughs> I love this. What is this? Charger. Oh, yeah, outlet. That is cool. And then this is the Peninsula Island. You got the built in microwave. Oh, here. Wow. I love this sink. Yeah, this sink is beautiful. Mm -hmm. Okay. Your washers and dryers are both sides. They're stacked on top of each other. As you get older, you really start to appreciate like nice You. you. <laughs> <laughs> Anytime I see an appliance, I'm like, what does it do? Right. As you get older, it becomes real important. How big is the washer and dryer? Can I fit more than one load? So it's really good with somebody. Can I get a comforter in there? How many loads are we going to have to wash before we're finished? Right. <laughs> oh, this is crazy. So this one has a sunken tub. Okay. It's oh, wow. That is deep. It's deep. Yes. So you still have your shower head, so you still get the effect of the rainfall. Right. Like you would in the stand up, but this one has a tub, which is really nice too. Okay. Yeah. This is a deep closet too. Mm -hmm. There's so much turns so in here. It's good. So much to do. Yeah. 
do. And I like how there's built-in blinds. So definitely, you know, with animals or even people with the vinyl blinds, they break. Oh, true. Sure. Yeah. So the material, you have nothing to worry about. Okay. It's easier to function. And of course, like the blackout, like you said. Mm -hmm. Different. They are. <laughs> Some of them have the L shape, more of the C shape kind of look. Some of them have the elongated. Like I said, this moves. Or you could always move this closer in to give you more space in your living room. Oh, that's nice for the garbage. Yes, this one doesn't. You don't have your connection. Yeah, you have the washing dryer, and then this one has a little bit of extra storage. Okay. Oh, that's cool. Mm -hmm. Also, it's like mops, screens, yes. screens, whatever. Yeah, this one is more definitely more of like an open concept. Yes. Yeah. Very Look at that car. Another one that we saw. Yeah. Angles just a little bit more and a little bit wider, but the same kind of style. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> does it actually matter? It does. I'm not even joking. No. I'm not <laughs> I thought you were joking. No, it has a thing to you. As you should. As you should. You don't want nobody in your refrigerator? No. Nope. Put it on. Yep. That is cool. And you unlock it when you're, when you're ready for this. Exactly. Yeah. These, I don't know if it's on this side. But you have up on the floor. Oh, that's awesome. Mm -hmm. I like this stove too. Yes. Very smooth top. Mm -hmm. Your microwave. Oh, well, that's built different. In right? To the cabinet. So it gives you more of a sleep room. Oh, I didn't even notice that in the microwave. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's cool. So instead of having like the over the range, it's more sleep to give you more space. Yes. Love it. Love it. Yeah, I like the sink. You like the sink? <laughs> it's big. It is. Yeah, we normally leave around like nine, eight or nine. So, okay. But it's always just like a day trip. Gotcha! Oh, whoa. Okay. Oh, what is that? So this is like a brilliant home. So this is kind of like a built-in Alexa. So you can turn your lights off, turn them on, turn your music on. It has a camera, so if you have your cats, you can watch them on camera. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you miss them? <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh, this is... Whoa, it's like it never ends. This is so. Oh. Cool. <laughs> oh. Mm -hmm. The room. That's the balcony. For this. <laughs> <laughs> this is a house. I like this headboard. Dude, it, it's actually really nice. That's um. That is crazy. Now you wow at me. <laughs> you know, I have to turn that. The lights are gonna automatically come on when we walk in. What? Really? Oh, oh, they, oh my oh. god. Okay. Um. Y'all didn't have to do it. Mm -hmm. The shade moisture is so young mm -hmm. with the shade moisture. Yeah. So we did the shade moisture style. The bathtub in the shower. Mm -hmm. Look how like you said. That's a bow. Right? Uh, if, if I wasn't wearing a mask, you would see my mask. <laughs> this is crazy. This is Not the best of both worlds. Best of both. Do they turn off? Yes, it turns off. Mm -hmm. So it's part of that brilliant home. Okay. So you can set it to kind of have a motion kind of to it. It's like a whole separate apartment. So this would be considered the guest. <laughs> the guest? <laughs> the guest. Oh. The guest. Mm -hmm. They both have double vanity things. Is this just like extra closet space? It is. Mm -hmm. This is beautiful. This is, um, thank you. You're welcome. Holy. You could literally have like a little get together with family out here. Elevators that smell like dog piss. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys! <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. It was a pleasure meeting all of you. Happy holidays. You too. Thank you guys. Thank you. You're welcome. You too. Have a great day. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Have a great day.
Really? Yeah. So okay. the majority of our floor plan, well, more, majority of our amenity spaces will be on the ground floor. That's the Coffee Beach Girl. They're open from 8 to 3, Monday through Sunday. Uh -huh. Come downstairs, get your coffee. You just have to go on that one. And on this side, we have our Royal Throne. That was trending on Instagram for about two days, so we're very really? happy about that. If you work from home, we do have your six work cards right here. They're oh. first come, first serve. Internet's already included. One of my favorite wall well, yes. is going to be on the roof, so. So these will be first come first serve as well. We do not pay for that. We just ask that you get a lock to lock your back down. Even though it's e bar access only, you're just going to be an extra security. Okay. Last up is the gym. So your gym is open 24 hours a day as of, well, right now it's not. So it'll be open from 5 a.m. to 10 p.m. So max of 25 people and we have a personal trainer every other week. So I tell everyone no excuses. <laughs> Oh, it's nice. What is Scent Air? Scent Air, that's the. Oh, yeah. This is the scenario. So, this will be open all day, every day from 10 to 11. We're going to have a five hundred dollars. We have all the groceries. This gives me more like party vibes. Yeah, I can see what you mean. So I like this community just because of the size. We're only 260 of it. Pretty much connected. So this is the two bedroom model. Oh wow! This will be your dark package. Okay. This is pretty. Oh, there's look. Little so every apartment will have that mud room too, even the one bedroom. Now, main things to point out, in the one bedroom, you're either going to have that master style bathroom or you're going to have the guest style bathroom. Okay. And that's in yeah. regards to like, you have a walking shower on this side and then you have the soaking tub on that side. Can we walk in the room? Yeah, go ahead and look this. If y'all want anything to drink, check the refrigerator. Oh, thank you. I like the floors of the bathroom. I was telling you, like I like this headboard. It looks similar to mine, but it's a little more, it's like a little more velvety, I guess. Yeah. I like it. And I like this comforter too. Okay. Mm. I can buy it. Yeah. <laughs> so you said this is the dark package. That just means like it would be. Gray backsplash, black mm. pictures. Oh, okay. The next one is white backsplash gold. Oh. Oh, cool. This backsplash is cute. I like the way it's slanted. <laughs> I like the blue door. Yeah, yeah, the door. 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 Yeah, the Okay, that's really recent. 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 Okay, Holy sh- oh. Alright guys, so I was about to say intermission on apartment hunting, but we are done for the day. So right now we're all currently at Firebirds. We've been seated. We're all the table and we're just kind of figuring out what we want well we just ordered some appetizers super laid back in here we're just 
chilling anytime like after we're done with this process it's just nice to sit down and do nothing but eat because it is tiring actually pretty sure we'll be all right but it's definitely a tiring process yeah we're all just getting food now we're all really hungry we haven't eaten since this morning so very excited to eat so we just ordered our food at this point we're all just like there's no interaction we're just tired and we're ready to eat there's really not much you could do with no food in your system so we're just kind of waiting on that but overall today was a great day we toured some amazing spots as of now we've looked at nine different places which is definitely better than my last move-in process or touring process i'm very happy about that i feel like i i mean i'm still not super familiar with the area but i do feel like i've seen a good amount of complexes in this area absolutely Okay, appetizer. So what are these? What is it again? I don't it's know. Philly 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 Philly. Philly. I've never heard of that, but that sounds fun. Do you have egg rolls? Yeah. yeah. But Philly cheesesteak, you just wouldn't expect that in an egg roll. Oh. Yeah. I've had it twice from different places. This is really? really? Yeah. Philly cheesesteak egg roll? Yeah, I'm very tired, but today was a great day. But for now, we're just gonna get some food in our system. Not sure if we're doing anything else after, but if not, I'm fine with that because we've had a pretty long day already. But yeah, I'll definitely get back to you guys in a little bit. We're close one, it's 20 minutes away. Should we go? Okay. Look, I'm not the one driving. If you're down to take a drive, we can do it. But if not, we don't gotta go. How you feeling? I mean, we're just gonna. Shit, right? mm -hmm. Okay, so right now it is 6.30 and we're back in the car after eating and I think we all feel better, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And um, we're about to go to Cold Stone because we want, you know, ice cream, milkshakes, whatever. Recently I tried the strawberries, but <laughs> strawberry, bless you. Sorry. Strawberry <laughs> banana smoothie from Cold Stone. Oh, our mm -hmm. I'm excited. <laughs> It's so weird because like I ate and I felt full when I stood up, but now my stomach feels empty again. But I got leftovers, so if I do want to eat again, I can, but my stomach's just weird like that. But I love my leftovers. I always do that. Did you want it? Uh, no, I'll go get it. Okay. That was a little food. Yeah, it was a whole yeah, burger. That's probably thrown away, babe. <laughs> it's about six fries. <laughs> <laughs> Normally by the end of this trip, the past two times we have went to the mall after. We're gonna go to Cold Stone instead because I don't think we're really feeling the mall. We just kind of walk around. Well, recently we were going to eat before, but there's other options. Are you done with this? Oh yeah. All right, we just got the Cold Stone and it looks closed, so we're about to see if it's open or not. Yeah. It is. Well, I mean, oh, it's open! Yay! <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, we're getting ice cream. It was a good day. Don't really know what else to say. Kind of tired, kind of dead, kind of not alive right now. It's out of focus and I don't like that. Oh, hey. Purr. <laughs> not purr. <laughs> What's goodie? In the motherfucking hoodie. This is my strawberry banana smoothie. This shit, it's good. This is my second time getting it. And the first time I got it, it tasted a little more realistic than I'd expected. It's probably concerning that I didn't expect it to taste like actual strawberry banana, but it's actually really good. And the whipped cream on top is bomb. It's like thick and it's super good. Thanks. Beautiful. <laughs> okay, we just got a cold stone. Is yours good? Tartar. Um, we're gonna do a first impression on this. Or I've had it before, but you know, it should be tasting different. <laughs> no, we're gonna do a first impression on this, but I had it before. <laughs> How'd that work? Alright. This is way better than last time. I don't know what they did different. I swear, like, I saw this girl getting it after I had it. I was like, Ain't no way, but this is a lot sweeter. I saw them actually put straight up ice cream in it, like strawberry ice cream or something, and I did not see them do that the last time. Wait, he put straight up strawberry ice cream in that one? Something. I saw him take ice cream or sherbet or something straight from the... It must have been sherbet if it's a smoothie. <laughs> yeah. All right, so we made it to Target. I don't think... Do we have a... I think Lee wanted to come here. You want to come here for Christmas gifts, right? Mm -hmm. We're just looking around for some Christmas gifts. Lee was actually going to do this in Greensboro. Yeah. But since we're already, you know, in an area that has one, we decided to swing by here instead. Instead of him doing it when he gets back. Exactly. You said what? That's what my niece needs. Her cage. <laughs> <laughs> you just don't listen. It's like a phone. It's just uh -huh. <laughs> 
I literally just saw this book and it unlocked a memory I forgot I had because my mom used to read this to me all the time as a kid and I forgot this was even a thing until I saw it and it, it hit me. That's crazy. Oh my gosh. Y'all don't understand. That like that, not me. That made me. I remember getting this book read to me, this one. I've definitely seen that one. The majority of these actually. That's crazy. I remember seeing this one. That's crazy. They still just have them here. <gasps> this one this one this one that's insane to me then again i'm literally like 12 so it's not that surprising but i just haven't seen them in so long all right so i'm looking at pop sockets because recently since i got a new phone i don't have a pop socket on the case i have and i want to get one because i have this thing in my car that's it's not really a tripod, but it's a little, it's something that I can kind of sew if I'm looking up directions on my phone or something. It's super easy to just have it there without it actually in my hand. So they have quite a bit of options here. So I'm just looking. This one is super cool looking. That's cool. I don't even know how to explain that. But this one is like a different, I feel like it's different sizing. I think it only works with the pop sockets that are flatter. I know it works for a fast with those and I don't want to risk it not working because I will most definitely not go out of my way to return it. This is fire. Or I could just get black. So I'm not going to get a pop socket because the ones that I liked, they were $15 and I'm not about to spend $15 on a one pop socket. So. <laughs> this is a two piece baby. <laughs> These candles smell good. This wildberry froze, froze. That's the weed. Bomb. Oh my gosh, like, this this Target got good candles. I remember the for that shit in like 2014. These all have really unique scents and they smell really good. All right guys, so I am back home. I am so tired. It's like almost 12 o'clock in the morning. I'm sitting on the toilet. I'm not actually in the toilet, but it's just a comfortable seating area. Today's been a long day. I feel like that was definitely the longest trip that we've taken. We just took more stops before we actually started heading back. We went to Target. We went to Cold Stone. We sat down and had like a full dinner, which we normally don't do. We'll like go to the mall and just go to the food court or something like that. So it was definitely a longer trip, but I think it was so worth it. And even and we're all super tired. I think we all had a good time and I think it was definitely worth it. Lee's back at home. Tamia is on the way back home. Sienna and Simi are at my house right now. Simi's spending the night again and then he'll go back home tomorrow. I can't even be complaining though because I did not do any driving today. Tamia actually offered to drive to you know where Lee lives and then from there we all drive together with Lee to these apartments. Tamia offered to drive. I did not ask her to drive so I really can't be complaining. I'm just so thankful to even have friends that would even offer to drive a decently long distance because they did not have to. We all just kind of take turns. I'll drive sometime. My friends will drive sometimes. It's a win-win situation. Yeah, no, but today was so much fun. And my goal, anytime I go to tour, is to at least love one of them. And honestly, everywhere that we looked today was so beautiful. And I feel like, I feel like these apartments were a lot different than the ones that we have previously looked at. It just showed me even more of a variety that the city has to offer and kind of just showed me how many different styles that they have. I just want to be in love with where I live. It's the wobbly toilet. I want to be in love with wherever I end up going and I know I most definitely will be. I know this is like my third time doing this video but apartment hunting is a process and it's not something I took you guys on the last time around so it's something I definitely wanted to take you guys along with this time around and I also I feel like I haven't been expressing this in the last couple of videos where we do go apartment hunting but I just wanted to say thank you guys so much. Without you guys this literally would not be possible and I am so very aware of that and I would never make it seem like you know this is something you guys are not a part of and not something that you guys helped create and make possible never do I want you guys to feel like I'm trying to act like y'all aren't us the sole reason this is even possible literally so thankful for all of you and I feel like it's only right for me to take you guys through this journey through this experience when you guys are the main reason I'm even able to do something like this yes I think it's totally okay for me to have privacy and certain things that I you know may not feel comfortable sharing or I just want to you know not have on social media of course but this is just something that I was super excited to share with you guys I was a little hesitant or nervous at first just because I didn't do it last time but I am super happy that I have taken you guys through this process so far but didn't I say I was gonna close off the video five minutes ago let's go ahead and get to cut to the chase baby so with all that being said, that's going to be it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys have got all the way to the end and you have not subscribed yet and you would like to, please make sure to do so. Also, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And if you hated it, give it a thumbs down. Whatever floats your boat, whatever helps you sleep at night. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I love you all so much and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.